it's not related to housing, but I wanted to inform people. Uh, tomorrow we're kicking off, actually we kicked off the campaign a couple of days ago, but uh, Senator Serrano, myself, Congressman Rangel, tomorrow at uh, 12 p.m. are kicking off, and I have a, one of the letters there, we're kicking off a campaign, East Harlem Against Deportation, and it, uh, it's a, a campaign local that's in continuation of some national efforts that really to keep raising the issue of the need to change our current immigration laws, which are extremely inhumane, which are separating families, which are just really, it's, they're unjust. So we're, we had an event in January here on 125th Street at a local church where over 1,200 people showed up to provide testimony about how they personally have been impacted by the current laws. And uh, it was great coverage. We got um, a lot of representation from our elected officials. And so Senator Serrano wanted to continue the campaign at a local level, so now we're doing East Harlem Against Deportation. And so we're engaging in a letter writing campaign you know, which we will distribute those throughout the different organizations to people for people to sign on, you know, asking and demanding of President Obama to change the current immigration laws. And he has indicated, you know, that there is a willingness there to change. Uh, we've been also putting pressure. I, I was part of a meeting with the pressure on Senator Gillibrand because she had some really, really bad immigration policy uh, positions that she had taken prior to becoming the senator as, as a congresswoman. So we challenged her on that. She's been revising her positions. Uh, and now, so you know, so this is a campaign that we're continuing to keep putting the pressure on. So we will be reaching out to the different organizations here as a way of having you help us in really get, gathering some of those testimonies so that we can really get as many as we can. I think we have a goal of a thousand for East Harlem letters that we can then send to President Obama. So.